Hey loves, welcome back to the channel Life of a Ninja Babe. My name is Judith and I'm a YouTuber based here in Abuja, Nigeria and my videos are basically about skincare, mostly about skincare and then sometimes vlogs and then lifestyle. So make sure you keep it locked on this channel. If you haven't subscribed, what are you waiting for? Please make sure you click the red subscribe button down below and turn on your post notification bell to always get notified whenever I post a new video. Sorry, I'm always used to adjust. So from the title of the video, you already know what I'll be talking about today in this video. And I'll be talking about how to promise the Revlon Realistic Natural Honey Moisturizing Body Lotion. And this is the Aloe Vera. This lotion is actually a very, very good moisturizing lotion. So far, it's my best moisturizing lotion if I want to use to pre-mix any of my body or lightening products. I've not used all the moisturizing lotions there there is in the market, but so far, this is my best moisturizer to use to pre-mix your lotion. If you want to get your lighter skin and you want to pre-mix a lotion that wouldn't give you knuckles, this lotion is very good for your pre-mixing because it's very high in moisturizing your skin and it's also hydrates your skin for a very very long time so i'll be teaching you how you can pro mix this lotion to achieve the best result in having a brighter skin a blemish free skin and a very clean spotlight skin so let's get down to our walk station so here we are in the walk um station here is my room actually and um you can see the ingredients are here already if you look at this lotion you see that i already have a part of this removed because i use this lotion four times like i divide it into four whenever i want to pre-mix simply because i want to get the best moisturizing and best effect from the pre-mixture that i do so right now i have mixed this part so usually i divide this into four that's one two three then four so i already used one part of this and now i'll be showing you guys how you could pre mix um this lotion it's very important not to always use all your lotion don't always pre mix the whole of your lotion simply because if you use all of them if you promise all of them is not number one is not really good for you to promix everything and keep it for a very longer period of time i just feel it reduces the efficacy of the lotion so it's better you mix it bit by bit so here i have my revlon lotion and i have my jeune Diouf, um egg yolk lotion this jeune Diouf is very good for clarifying your skin it helps to you know clear out dark spots and it leaves your skin very hydrated and it brightens your skin citro clear serum hmm. this serum here i can't even over emphasize on this serum this serum is a lemon extract serum and you can see it's anti-spot fast action this serum is a very good serum it works in clearing your dark spot it works in leaving your skin very smooth and of course you know anything that has lemon is actually very good so that is why we have to also include this citro clear concentrated serum now remember that this lotion is a moisturizing lotion so you need to use as good um oil as possible sorry the light has gone off i don't know what's wrong with my phone then we have pigment do if you are into skincare, you know that Pimendo is a very good um, serum. This Pigmento Concentrate. They have the Pigmento Lotion, but this is the Concentrate. This Concentrate is very active, is very good. And there is a particular quantity you are to mix, you are to add to your pro mixed lotion. When you're pro mixing, you don't use everything. I told you guys that. So just let's go down to mixing this um, Revlon Lotion. And here I have my bowl for mixing this cream and my plastic spoon. I prefer to use plastic to mix to promix my lotions just because it's my preference. So if you have a bigger bowl, it's fine, or a bigger plastic to use to promix is fine. I mean the plastic for mixing is fine if you can use a bigger one. I don't have the bigger one, I don't know where I kept it. So let's get down to mixing this cream so here I pour in quarter 
of my lotion yeah but uh, you can see how silky smooth this lotion is it's very smooth and hydrating and then here we're going to be using two teaspoons of this Junduf. if you don't have the exact of this um spoon please you can use a teaspoon okay let me move it further so we can you use we use two um two teaspoon of this Junduf. and the next um in um, next oil will be adding the next serum will be the citro clear concentrated serum and this will be adding two teaspoon this is because this is to actually clear out any dark spots you have or any blemishes you have on your skin and then the pigment dough because this my own teaspoon is a bit bigger you shake this is the pigment dough we'll be adding one teaspoon you can see part of it has already gone into this mixture so we'll be adding one teaspoon if you have a smaller teaspoon than this please use it but this is what i use so you pro mix it you mix very well i always use citro clay serum in place of tube creams i especially when i already have a clarified skin for now there's no really need for you to use a tube cream but if you want you can also still add like half teaspoon of tube cream that has to get a very high high lightning effect but this pro mixture is okay you can see do you see how smooth it is this is how smooth it's going to be on your skin and this is how it's going to leave your skin feeling smooth and very hydrated i'm not a fan of using a lot of mixtures in my face creams or my body creams to achieve a good effect you know can you see how moisturizing can you see this is how it feels it feels really smooth this is how to promix your revlon realistic natural honey to get the best effect of it if you want it to get to lighten you with continuous usage in in the next two three weeks you're gonna see the lightening effect of this lotion so if you still choose to add a tube cream is so fine like the three beta cream or the clean cap like one teaspoon because this is a very little mixture so this is the best way to pro mix your revlon realistic natural honey this is how you could mix it to get a good brightening or lightening effect and at the same time leaving your skin very well hydrated and highly moisturized so i'll end the video here until next time bye